everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Emily and I talk a lot about Salesforce. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you how to sign up for a free CRM enabled developer edition org through Salesforce. Salesforce, I guess a couple years ago, bought Tableau. And so they've been working to create some really awesome CRM analytics tools that kind of cross over both areas. So I will link this down below the sign up for the org. But let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna just type in my name. My name is Emily Call. And then my email address, I'm gonna have this be kind of a a burner email address, call cloud consulting at gmail.com. Okay, and then I have, let's say I'm a developer. And then a company, I'm gonna say call solutions. Country, postal code 90210. Oh, that is not my postal code. And then the username, I'm gonna say test Emily C at uh, callsolutions.com. All right. And the username does need to be unique. So just make sure that you have some type of unique thing when you are signing up for this, uh, just so then you can remember it later on. I'm gonna hit sign me up. All right, and now they're going to send me an email. This can take up to 20 minutes is how long it's taken for me before. So just keep an eye on your email and it should hit the inbox. I'm going to um, edit this down so then uh, you'll just see the process after I get the email. I'm back, we it took about um, two to three minutes for this to go ahead and pop in in my inbox, depending on what type of org you're creating and how long the, I guess the quote unquote line is for the API call to create a new account is, um, it could take a lot longer. So I'm happy to say that it what didn't take that long. I am going to verify account. All right, so I do need to create a new password for it. Um, Does need to be eight characters, one letter and one number. And then what city were you born in? Um, Salesforce. I am going to change my password, which is really just setting my password because I haven't really set a password yet. And it looks like we are in. One thing I do want to check is I want to go and double check that we have the analytics. So the first thing that I saw was that we have um, Analytics Studio and they said on their page when we signed up that they had some data for us to go ahead and browse through. We can click create. We can talk about or we could go in and create apps, dashboards, components, models, and data sets. We can go ahead and go in and look at some of the different analytics that we have. So that is how you sign up for a CRM analytics developer account. Um, I like to use these if the company I am working for is thinking about using these and kind of demoing and learning myself about the different features that are enabled and that we can use before we actually purchase the software. So that way we can get a more in-depth look. Of course, these are gonna be limited in what they can do um, in storage space. So you can't use these for your actual job, but using it for testing purpose, for studying purposes is totally awesome. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope that you found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to give it a like, subscribe. You can connect with me on LinkedIn and Twitter at Emily Call MBA. You can check out the courses in the description um, or on salesforceupskill.com. Thank you so much and I'll catch you guys in the next one.